At Parker Gale, our motto is products that matter, cultures that last. It's right there at the top of the website. And that's not lip service. It's embedded in everything we do to help our portfolio companies reach their full potential. The world is only becoming more volatile, uncertain, complex, and ambiguous. And on top of that, we're asking our leaders to transform a founder-owned business to a sophisticated, fast-moving, private equity-backed business. Pre-Parker Gale, most decisions, most work flows through the founder. Two years after the Parker Gale investment, there are at least two dozen leaders throughout the organization driving and propelling the organization forward. They are connecting work to strategy, connecting work to purpose. They're building belonging across the organization, and they're helping their employees do the disruptive, innovative work to propel an industry forward. To build that type of leadership capacity systematically takes an unbelievable amount of work, and our partner in doing that transformational work is Wind and Sail Leadership. They help the leaders inside the business transform, and through that personal transformation, the business transforms and we unlock the full potential of our portfolio businesses. Our program is a cohort-based model that is comprised of over 40 hours of live training, one-on-one -on -one leadership coaching, and a 360 leadership assessment. The content starts by having leaders go inward so they can really know themselves. They look at what their strengths are, their values, what their purpose is, and how that's connected to the organization. We then go outward and talk about what's needed to lead the team. Areas like delegation, inclusive management, and coaching skills for leaders. And then finally, we amplify impact by helping leaders understand the conditions that support thriving, what those peak performance strategies are. So for me, the experience has been really, really necessary and joyful. I've enjoyed it, I thought it was really, really fun. And I thought it was a different take on leadership uh, training. There was uh, an element of you know, self-reflection and uh, assessment of who you are that was in the mix of it, which was uh, really what kind of made the connection for me in terms of picking up some new skill sets. The specific content that's most impactful for me is getting on the balcony. Getting on the balcony takes, it means taking time uh, to get a different perspective, to reassess, to see things from a different perspective, allowing you to create a better plan for the situation. I run a services team and we are constantly in chaos. We call ourselves firefighters, right? And so you can't really get that perspective when you're firefighting all the time. And it's very useful to get on the balcony, reassess, and then come up with a plan. So uh, getting on the balcony is something that I will be using throughout the rest of my career. If there's a belief that animates what I do, it's that leaders create culture through their words, their behaviors, their values, and their actions. Research also shows that great leadership is not an innate skill. It's one that's grown and cultivated over time. From a leadership standpoint and in my day to day, you've got you know, a jam-packed schedule, you've got 10 different priorities coming at you at the same time. Being mindful, especially in those moments, I think, has been critical because it's allowed me to pause and say, am I actually focusing on the most important things right now? I've been able to block out the noise more and focus on the things that are more important. I've started blocking out hours of my Fridays to think purely about strategic planning. So my journey with uh, Wind and Sail has actually taken me pretty far. When I started the program, I was a leader of 20 people and mostly leading the work they were doing and not really leading the people. And now, uh, three years after that, and still working with Katrina and a man in the team, I'm leading a team of 90 people uh, with 15 other leaders on my team. And really, my focus is leading those other leaders and helping them to evolve and, and go on their own journeys. What do we see in the months after the program? It's pretty simple. We see employees with a stronger sense of company purpose, values, and strategy. We see a stronger sense of belonging across the departments and the geographies. Uh, and we see managers with stronger management practices that allow us to invest in and retain our highest performing employees. One of the things I really appreciate about Parker Gale is they understand the power of investing in their leaders and in their managers. Um, Parker Gale has made a substantial investment in prophecy and leadership in helping them become more mindful, skillful, and effective leaders because they understand the power 
and it can have to a business and their ability to grow, differentiate, and transform a company into a high-performing business. At the end of the day, we do one thing. We invest in founder-owned B2B software businesses and invest in the product and the people to unlock their full potential. Easy to say, hard to pull off. If you're looking for an opportunity to do important purpose work, if you want to work with executive leaders and a financial backer who will make investments in you as a leader, if you want to build products that matter and cultures that last, then let's talk. Come join the team that believes in the